Hello, my name is Charles, and today we're going to be playing a little game. It is my pleasure to introduce you to today's episode of Truth or Fail, English edition. Hmm. I am going to tell you two English-related facts. One of them will be true, and one of them will be false. And it is up to you, the viewer, to guess which one is true. There is no prize for winning, so there is really no point in playing. But if you're a bit bored or don't have the ability to do anything but click on things, this is the game for you, so I can't be bothered to do this character anymore. I'm sorry. Ugh. Right, hello. It was me, all along. Ah. There are lots of other episodes of True or Fail, all themed, and as the English one, I've been given the task of doing the English-based questions. Ah. I hope you have fun, and I hope you learn something along the way as well. It's always good to have fun and learning at the same time. Fact number one! The name of the cricketing competition, The Ashes, comes from the urn used as a trophy which contains the actual ashes of a burnt cricket ball. Or number two, if a whale is found washed up on an English beach, its head belongs to the king. Click on one of these. It's your job to click on one of these. It's either that one or that one. One of the two. Doobity doo. Click on one of them. It's your job. Or you don't have to if you don't want to, but I would like it if you did, so I can stop doing this. boo ba doo ba doo click on one of these. doo ba doo ba doo click on one of these. Fine, you don't have to click on anything if you don't want to. I hate you.